Hey everyone, I'm back. Um, this is my response to the second half of this week's lesson. Uh, we were directed to watch Paint, a documentary that the History Channel made. It is was incredibly informative and I really enjoyed watching it to be honest. Um, but really, what is paint? I mean, the History Channel thought enough about paint to make a hour-long show about it. So, what is it? Um, paint is a pigmented liquid that dries to form a solid film. Uh, it's used on basically everything, as you'll find out if you ever watch the video. Um, it's made up of three parts, resin, pigment, and solvent. Resin's your binder. I don't know why I did that. Anyways, pigment is your colorant. Without pigment, you would have no color. You'd have a colorless painting. And your solvent is what makes your paint flow. Very important. Um, examples of these things would be resin as a linseed oil, pigment as ground up minerals, and solvent as water, since that makes things flow. Um, we were also asked in this question how long a painting should last. Um, for me, as an artist, um, I don't think that answer is questioned until I'm creating the painting. I, um, I think a painting should last as long as the painting is meant to last. So if an artist doesn't want the painting to last, it won't. Um, in the case of Da Vinci's Last Supper, he I would assume he wanted it to last for an ever and ever, but he was an innovator and he tried something new that didn't work and sometimes that happens. Which is a shame because it's a beautiful painting. Um, but other things last a really long time. So, I mean, 30,000 years later, we still have cave paintings which was the only form of communication, really. I mean, there was no writing manuscripts 30,000 years ago, but we know what they were eating, we know how they were eating, um, and there's a communication that has lasted for 30,000 years, um, which I think is incredible and... Um, Something that's untangible, you know. So how long should a painting last? Um, I'm not sure. Um, I think it's up to the artist. And I think if paintings don't survive now, in this day of age, it's because they're not meant to. Um, thanks, everyone. I'll see you next week.